Charlie, and Charlie, just turning to Andrew for a second, do you think he's in more trouble on the 1st of January when the absolutely. Epstein list is announced? Oh, absolutely. He's on the list anyway. I mean, it, his name being on another list doesn't doesn't add all that much to what's been going on. He's paid £12 million pounds to a woman he claims he's never met. But, Charlie, it you might know. show that he visited a lot more times than he's actually admitted. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Um, it, it depends what the list shows, whether it's just a list of a list of names who are linked with Epstein or a list of people who were involved in a great many ways with Epstein and his nefarious goings-on in the background. I mean, Andrew's just going to have to... You know, sit on his hands and and hopefully not. It doesn't look too bad for him. I mean, he if he thinks he's going to hide away from a in a within a list of some famous names, well, he's going to be one of the most famous names on that list. He's going to be right at the top of it. Yeah. Uh, can we come back to Christmas then at Sandringham? What do yeah. they? And, and we know that they do. They do enjoy. Um, a, a bit of a game, a board game, don't they? Is it board games that they play? I can't, they do I'm play saying? board yeah. games, all except Monopoly. That got banned because everybody had an argument. As, a, as mm. a, Not just the whole family, but other families as well argue about buying Mayfair or Park Lane mm. or everything else. Is it just because <laughs> they own most of the property in Britain anyway? <laughs> <laughs> You're so much right about it, Russell. They, they, own, <laughs> they own the Monopoly boards. <laughs> Do you know, there is an interesting story in The Times today, actually. There's a mathematician who's worked out what you need to do to win at Monopoly. And, oh, my goodness, I look at it and I just think, why didn't I? Apparently you have to buy all the orange ones and put loads of hotels all over them. Yeah, well, I mean, I just tossed the dice and hope for double sixes all the way, but... <laughs> <laughs> But anything else that is done at Christmas time that perhaps is not done at Christmas uh, elsewhere? Uh, no, I, I think it's a pretty regular uh, occurrence. I mean, we, we all know that they, 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 they hand out their presents on Christmas Eve, which is the German tradition. And the presents are... are un, un, unusually, the presents are not expensive presents. They are jokey-style presents. You know, like Prince Anne, uh, Princess Anne gave Charles once a, 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 a loose seat. Um <laughs> And uh, <laughs> Catherine, Catherine actually gave Harry at one time when they were all speaking together a, a make your own girlfriend uh, uh, set. I, I, I often wonder what that would have been like, but never mind. Um, so it's all jokey presents, um, and they, they'll just be getting on. I think uh, the Waleses will probably have left by now. They will be down in Bucklebury with uh, Catherine's uh, parents enjoying a second Christmas. Yeah. Do. And what about New Year's Eve then, for the royal it's family? Just, well, they'll, they'll be, they'll have, by then the, most of them will have gone their separate ways. It'll just be the 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 the, the, the king, queen, and maybe a few friends still there, um, a few other friends coming up. Um, yeah, it's 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 a normal family event. You know, we, we'll all go visit friends, or friends will come and visit us, and we'll just do the normal things really. Charlie, thank you so much. Charlie Pleasure. Ray, former Royal Editor of The Sun.